Hello, my friends, and welcome back to the lost episodes of Doom. Today we are on E2M3 IO Toxic Disposal Plant. Ooh, that was interesting. I wonder, I wonder how that worked. I didn't get, I didn't move, but I didn't get the shotgun until I pushed the button. That was very interesting. All right, so lots of him. That's fine. This is kind of a cool setup. I'm loving these support pillars. Like the detailing on this one is really good. It's it's still like a basic era doom, right? It's not super over detailed, but it is making some really good use of textures and space and I approve. All right. Pick up some more shells. We are full up on that. Ow! Okay. I see that shotgunner hiding back there. Okay. So the problem one of the Ooh, that's ominous. And this doesn't there's a key in there. None of these open though. Wait, wait. There's weird brighter lines here. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know about this. Ooh. One of the only uh, issues I have, like the experimental approach, as I've mentioned many times throughout the series, I don't know that it actually produces good level. But one thing it does do is it produces an interesting level. Now, that's fine. Yeah, that's good. And, you know, I like seeing what comes out of that. Unfortunately, it also means that I can never quite trust them, right? This is the kind of thing where at any moment, ugh, there could be a random crusher or a sudden Mr. Peepers, right? Doom 64 kind of had that problem early on, where they started off with the very first secret level, had a bunch of nasty insta-kill death traps. And from then on, it's like, I can't, I can't trust you. Ah. Okay. I don't really, let me, let me blow these up. Were there barrels in here? There sure were. Didn't even notice. Okay. Um, so it looks like there is stuff down at the end of those hallways. Uh, we also have two more rooms. I don't really want to go down there. Uh, I'm assuming that the, the sludge there is all hurt for. Hello? I did hear growling. They're in here. Oof. Okay. We have a blue key. Hello? Wow. There's a party going on down there. How about on this side? Yep. We will clear all that nonsense out. Okay. Interesting. We don't have a yellow key to open that up, though. Do you see anyone else down there? No. What I might end up doing is we have that, uh... Imbalm sphere. Maybe we'll grab that and then run over into that pit. Oh, okay, we found the exit. We need a red key to get in there, though. So the only place I have left to go is the toxic room. So, okay, first... Ah! And this leads me right in there. Okay. Interesting. Alright, let's... Let's, uh... Keep the pace up in here. There's lots of health, but I don't really want to end up stuck down here. So, oh, a rad suit. I will gladly take that. Oof. You thought normal flashbangs were bad. Ugh. Okay. Okay. Um, I haven't looked down these. Nothing there. Okay. 
Uh, and then that's that room. Okay, I think I think we need to get out of here now. So this side is clear. Now I think I can go around. Oh, hello, yellow key. Um, you're throwing me off now. Hold on. Let's before we go and try and use this key. Let's hop down here. Ah. Ow. Okay, okay. I don't know what is going on here. Oh, dirty. Secret room, huh? Okay. This reminds me... Didn't I have a level... Was it part of Lost Episodes? I remember pretty recently a room... I don't think it was Doom 64, so it must be this. Where there were these kind of pillars, and I was commenting on the triggers for them or something. I don't I don't remember. Is one of these a switch? Is that what's going on here? That's obnoxious. Let's see what we got. I'm assuming none of them are uh shootable switches, because that would be even more annoying to try and trigger. But I see that white. That white spot on the wall. And so that makes me think there is more to this room than meets the eye. So let's just do a quick check. Okay, that's two sides. Let's check the back side. No. Come on, man. Don't make me waste all this time trying all this. There it is. Yeah. Okay. Um, did I want to come out of there? We haven't been down that way yet. Uh, where did we go? We came in here and we hopped down there. And that was the only thing down there. Okay, cool. So let's turn around. And nope, that's not what I meant to do. Uh, I'll put up here. Okay. And then I want to take... We don't have the red key yet, but we have the yellow key now. Uh, not this room. Is it this room? I think it's this room. Yeah. Let's see what this is. The red key. All right. So now I can just get out of here, I guess. Right? Right? Why would you give me the computer area map here? Okay. So there's a room. Oh, well. <laughs> Don't give you the computer area map when you're in a hole you can't escape from. What what nonsense is that? All right, we got time for one more here. Let's do E2M4, Weapons Testing Facility. Okay. Ah! Ah! You know, I've noticed episode two, in contrast to episode one, really loves having very, very spicy starts. I'm not a fan, I gotta say. Whoa! Is that our first Kako? I think it is. Oh. Come on, come on. There we go. All right, look at all this out here. What are you shooting at? There we go. Okay, let's... Ow! Ow! Uh... There we go, finally. Ah! Uh, help! I'm stuck! There we go. Okay. Gross. Okay, get a Berserk so we can deal with Pinkies more effectively going forward. Don't need armor, don't need health, don't need bullets. I will take rockets. Anything special here? Not really. We have two teleporters. Do they both take me back? They sure do. And I don't have a blue key, so we will not go that way. Let's try this side. Okay, let's put that berserk to use. Ow! No! Not very effectively. You know, it is what it is. Okay. I hear... Whoa. 
Why? 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 Well, that doesn't really justify an invuln exactly, but it is concerning. Uh, rockets. I remember, there was a BFG in the first level that I didn't pick up, so this could be... This is weird, man. I don't even know what to make of this. Alright, we got the red... What do we got here? Computer area map. Okay, hey, I'll take that. Gladly. Um... Okay. So, we have a red key. We don't have a blue key yet. So I guess we'll go this way. Oh, and did you notice that? Something that... I know the official campaign did a little bit, but really didn't do very often. Check that out. One-sided key door. Once you go in, you can't come out. I know there was a spot in Episode 2. It might have even been Episode 2... M3 or 4 that did the same thing. I remember it doing it with the yellow door, but uh, you don't see that very often. It's a clever, clever gating trick. All right. Okay. What do we got here? Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Ah. Okay. And the blue key. And this switch doesn't trigger. That's weird. Oh, they both trigger the same thing. What do they trigger? The door out, maybe? Weird. Very bizarre. Um. Wait a minute. Oh, I don't have a yellow key. Okay, I'm like, wait a minute. There's a blue door in front of me, but we haven't gone through this whole area back here yet. No, we have not. But we also don't have all the keys we need, so there we go. Ah, all right. Try this again. One. Okay, I think we can, we can get this. There we go. Howdy. Ah! All right, let's just run to the end. Nope, okay. All right, door number one. Oh, these are cool. Very Tom Hall-esque. What you hiding in the closet for? Call these goodies up. Uh, what's going on back here? Oh, the shower. Tub, toilet, very nice. We're in some kind of a barracks here, looks like. Yeah! Okay. Oh! That's... a lot of yellow keys. <laughs> Interesting. Uh, I already did that one. Let's go down here. Okay. Howdy. Just looking around. Not much to see here, unfortunately. The theming's kind of cool, but they're not really... It's not really doing anything with it. Although... Hello! Ha <laughs> ha! I will gladly take all that. Okay. And what do we got in the final closet here? We've killed all the enemies. And we're missing one item. That's okay. Let's get out of here, shall we? That was not too bad at all. Oh, almost made it. Yo! We are kind of stacked right now. Full health, full armor, blue armor, full bullets, full shells. We could use some more rockets and some more cells, but we are we are in a pretty pretty nice position. Look at that. Hmm. Love it. All right.
Not a hot start. Chef's kiss. Always love not a hot start. I'm also noticing a trend with these where the exit is in the same room as the entrance, which is an interesting design, and I'm, I'm kind of here for it. Anyway, we will leave this one here. My friends, I want to thank you so much for watching. If you're enjoying this, please hit that like button. It really helps me out, and I will see you next time.